Welcome back, everybody. Hey, we're here for episode two of our Let's Play Minecraft Bedrock series. Um, in today's little episode, we're going to go try and find some um, some more wood. I mean, oak wood's kind of boring. Um, if you if you missed the last episode, go back and watch it, but I'll just repeat it. Um, the plan for this little base is to is to build like a shipwreck starter home. Uh, we wrecked our big ship into this island and we kind of just made it our home because we have the, the captain's quarters and all that stuff. Um, so we, we need some different types of wood to, to make this ship a little bit interesting. All right. So what we're going to do right now is we're going to get some uh, stone axes since we don't have a whole lot of iron yet. And uh, we're going to go see if we can go find some wood. Uh, saplings would be preferable. Um, bring them back and, and just plant them and go. So we'll we'll see how that goes. And for the time being, um yeah, we're we're just getting prepared. We're getting prepared for a little a little trip out to who knows where. All right, and here we go. As you can see, we found some coal. Um, I don't know about you guys, but 1.118 update, man, that coal seems to be hard to find now. Um, but I brought my pickaxe that was pretty much dead on arrival. Uh, so we need some trees or some wood, get some wood planks, uh, make, a, uh, make a crafting table here and so we can uh, see if we can get just a little bit more stone and we'll go from there uh, get a pickaxe or two so we can collect some of this coal to take back to our base oh and, and it broke okay well at least we got this one that should be good just in case we'll get three more in case we need more but uh here we go let's let's grab this coal before we go tree hunting i'm really looking for birch um, I really like how birch looks. Uh, again, this is the Chroma Hills uh, X128 texture pack um, that I play with. As you can tell, it's not vanilla Minecraft. Um, and I, I like the way birch looks in this in this texture pack. So that that's what we're hunting for. But we'll see if we can get some saplings to get a nice little wood farm going, maybe. And here we go. Let's let's sleep. Let's try to sleep before we start getting attacked by monsters. Remember, we don't have any armor yet, so we're pretty vulnerable. Hey, look, iron. Cool. That was unexpected. That's a nice surprise. So let's just go ahead and grab this real quick. We'll make do with two, I guess. And let's go try to get some more coal. There we go. So I have a question for everybody that's actually watching. Uh, leave a comment down in the comment sections if, if you have any suggestions. But other than our little base, what, what should we do next? Uh, we're going to, in the next episode, we are going to start working on the shipwreck slash house slash little starter base. Um, then we'll go from there. But what what should we work on after we, we start the house um, or the shipwreck, the shipwreck house? Uh, should we work on some like a fuel source, infinite fuel source? Should I go get some kelp and and maybe do like a little a little mini kelp farm thing uh, to get us started with fuel? Um, I'm gonna be mining hopefully soon, um, and that'll all be on stream. So hopefully when we mine, we can 
find a nice big deep cave and get some dripstone uh, and uh, some dripstone blocks and dripstone and maybe uh, a bucket of lava and hopefully we can uh, hopefully we can do that I have yet to create a new lava farm I haven't done that yet since this updates come out uh, believe it or not I played in three maybe four different worlds possibly five since the 1.18 update and I have yet to run into any dripstone. I found the dripstone blocks, but I haven't found the I haven't found the pointy dripstones um, to make a, a lava farm or an infinite lava source, if you will. Um, so that could be something we work on. We could also work on maybe uh, capturing some sheep and some cows because um, eventually we're going to need leather. Uh, we're also out here looking for some some sugar cane to get started. On a little sugar cane farm, so we we'll be working on that here too pretty soon. All right, forty two coal is that enough? Let's see. I don't know. I guess we can take this. I know this is kind of boring. I'm sorry, guys, but <laughs> this coal is like real real world gold. <laughs> But just in Minecraft, uh, I, it's hard to find now, and I didn't find any on my island. I think I found a couple, but not enough to be relevant, you know? So we're, we're going to take this with us in our travels. As you can see, I have 27 torches here. All right, where's my boat? And copper, I don't want to see any copper ever again. It's cool. I'm glad there's some new blocks in Minecraft, but I, I dug out enough copper um, and only having a few uses for it just isn't very neat to me, but that's cool. Look at that. Pretty nice. Yeah, I'm loving the 1.18 update. Uh, just the, the terrain features are, are so cool looking. Um... I really, I really like the cliffs idea of it. I, I thought some of these hills in Minecraft are cool, but for the most part, not really. Uh, I mean, did anybody ever play with the amplified texture packs? I don't think that was ever a, a bedrock thing. I think that was only Java edition, but I saw some maps with amplified terrains or whatever it was, and that seemed to be pretty cool. That would have been fun to build like a little cliffside base into. And now that's possible for us bedrock players. Hey, here we go. Here's some birch. I'd like to get uh, three or four saplings, maybe. We'll be happy with three. All right, come on. I feel I feel kind of bad just leaving this tree all barren, but <laughs> I just want the saplings for now. Maybe, maybe in a future episode, like episode 56 or something, we can come back here and and trust me, I haven't played this map enough to do 56 episodes. Um, I think from my past stream, I can get two, possibly three episodes out of it. Yeah, let's just cut it down. Why not? Let's not leave it there. Birch is my favorite tree to chop down because you can always chop down the tallest, the tallest wood block. From, from wherever you're standing, from wherever the base of that tree is. Uh, I think that's the only tree that you can do that with. Because oak can sometimes grow in those weird, crazy, big oak tree patterns that I just despise. And it makes you tower up and knock away all the leaves just to try to see if you left any wood, uh, wood blocks laying around. All right. Two, can we get two more saplings here? So yeah, if you just need wood um, for whatever, I think the most efficient wood there would be is probably birch. And people will argue with me. But I say birch wood is, if you're making like a, a boatload of chests or something, yeah, or maybe barrels, I don't know. I, I still think birch is more efficient just because you don't have to tower up. You don't need to 
tower down. You don't have to star staircase it up. Um, yeah, you can mine every every tree block from where you're standing uh, at the base of it. So, and again, I can't find my boat. There we go. Yeah, so what, what, what do you guys think? What, what's the most efficient wood type to... I, I quote unquote mine because you're not really mining it, you're just chopping it down. Oh, this looks interesting. Oh, nice little waterfall. Okay, cool. Cool. We're on a mission, guys. We're, we're trying to find some different sapling types. Uh, we have acacia and birch right now. But let's just take a moment. Let's just take a moment and appreciate this new terrain generation. Man, this is gorgeous. Look at this. Wow. That's cool, man. They, you know, Mojang and Microsoft, they did 1.18. They did it well. They did it well. That's pretty cool. I love the vines. I love, I love the look the vines give this right now. All right, but let's stay on course here. Let's. I think we got a good start on coal. We're not going to stop for all this. <clears throat> let's go find some sugar cane. Nope. Still no sugar cane. I don't know. I don't know if we're gonna find any sugar cane, guys. Not not with all these stony. Not with all these. Look at that floating block. Interesting. Yeah. Not with all this stone here, we're not gonna find much. But hey, bamboo. Bamboo can be a good uh, starter source for fuel. Instead of having to use coal or other wood blocks, I mean, bamboo grows pretty fast. Just use it as a fuel source. Because it counts as a wood block, so. Okay. Still no sugar cane. That's all right. But there's a parrot there, too. I could collect these seeds, but that's not our focus right now. Don't know how I missed those. Well, hey, seeds. Nah, we're going to not worry about the parrot right now. We'll come back. We know where this jungle biome is now, so we can always come back if we want. So sugar cane, let's go. Still nothing. Oh, yeah, but, I mean, aside from maybe sheep cow farm or possibly a kelp farm, lava farm, some sort of fuel source farm, what do you guys think we should build next? Um, I'm gonna have to go mining for some <laughs> for some materials. Um, hopefully, get some iron, enough iron, and possibly either the next episode or the episode following this one. Um, get kitted up with some sort of iron, um, and even if it comes down to it, if we get enough cows, we can we can do that. But let's. Let's see if we get any jungle saplings. One. Uh, it's enough for now, I guess. Not really too worried about jungle. I've built so many different jungle themed with jungle wood builds that I'm just kind of over jungle wood right now. Jungle wood does look pretty cool though. I'm um, in this Chroma Hills texture pack, so I will give it that. But now we're just not. I don't think this is a good decision to come this way. I don't believe we're going to find any sugar cane. Uh, what's up here? Light? Oh, be careful with that lava. Starting to get nighttime. I should probably sleep, but here we go. I'm just running. Is there a safe place to sleep? I don't really want to sleep out in the open. No, not there. Interesting cave up there, maybe. Let's not worry about it too much right now. I'm getting hit by something. Let's use this this axe. All right, that's fine. Okay. I don't think I'm gonna be able to sleep here, even if I want to, just because of the amount of mobs that are around. Oh, baby zombie was on his back. Look at that. I thought I saw it, but I wasn't. 100% sure. Hey, Parrot. 
But let's try to get back to the water, um, get in our boat. Uh, water should be around this way. That's cool looking. Yeah, the caves are pretty cool too in this update. But yeah, just just drop some suggestions down below in the comment section of what, what we should build next. Uh, once we get our little starter base. Uh-oh, creeper. Get out of there. Uh, once, once we get started and complete our little shipwrecked boathouse. Um, what should we, what should we work on? Uh oh, something hit me. Where is it? I did not mean to do that. Uh oh, oh come on, we're gonna die. But yeah, there it is. There she blows. I need to start making a, a death counter, but hey, I actually spawned back in at the original spawn of this world, and I just cut through everything, getting back to my nether portal. Whoa, what was that? That boat was on fire. That was that was really wild. Um, this episode's not going very well, <laughs> um, but yeah, Barber. My buddy Barber worked on this ice highway. Um, I was not able to play very much last week after the initial stream and after the first video was posted. Um, I'm, I'm a married man and you know my wife needs time with me and I my dogs need time with me. Um, my friends wanted to see me and I'm not complaining at all. That That's all great and everything. But here we are taking a little ice highway. Um, we're not going to show this whole clip because it's a long clip still, even even with the ice highway. But this is awesome. Thank you, Barber, for doing this. Um, you didn't have to. But let's get back to it. Um, we should be coming up here. I can't remember exactly where I cut this clip, but let's let's get back to it. All right, sorry for that odd uh, jump scene there. Um, I've watched a couple of tutorials with this video editing, video editing software, but hey, you know what? That's all right. But hey, we're back off since we died. I think I'm going to go try to find the stuff that I dropped. And I think I, rent, I went the wrong way, but holy cow. I love these little tropical oceans these warm oceans with all the coral and everything yeah that's pretty cool but yeah i don't remember the coordinates of where i was but i think i went the wrong way and we're just gonna abandon hope uh, let's just go try to get some saplings uh, maybe and we'll go a little bit further here just to see if we get lucky, but I think, in recollection, I think I went left when I should have went right. If you french fry when you're supposed to pizza, you're not going to have a good time. But yeah, that's how she goes sometimes, right? Alright, well, whatever. Well, what is this? Hey, look at this. That's cool. Here's a mess up. That's a cool mess. Uh, I wonder if there's anything cool. Like one of those exposed mine shafts. That'd be cool. But, uh, well, here's some goodies, I suppose. We can take this cactus. I do love the scion die. Scion. 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 Cayenne. Now let's just go get another cactus. Um, that'll get us started. But yeah, we got our sugar cane now. We got seven sugar cane. Uh, that'll be a decent start to a, a little mini sugar cane farm. Um, guess we can go grab some more saplings, maybe. I mean, we all that coal that we mined is now gone, and that's kind of sad. Uh, but it is what it is. Um, because I died so often, <laughs> I I went ahead and made myself a, a 
iron sword. So I used two of my seven iron that I had. Um, I guess I guess we'll see if it pays off for us here in a minute, but I guess you can't really go wrong with an iron sword, right? Man, not a whole lot of saplings. Okay. Well, we got one, two. That should be good. Let's go get some birch saplings again. Because that, that's really what I wanted was birch saplings. But that's that's pretty cool. I, I just... I love the look and the feel of Minecraft. Um, and especially now that I'm playing on a... On a computer. Windows 10 Edition, not Java. Let's not confuse the two. This is still Bedrock. But, yeah, I just... Ever since this newest update, Cliffs and Claves update... Cliffs and caves update. Yeah, I just the worlds just look so cool. And then just seeing it on this on this computer and how I mean much better graphics card. I mean it's not a a terribly strenuous game at all, even for an Xbox, but yeah, it just looks so much better on laptop slash PC. Okay, only only one birch sapling there, okay. That's not very cool. All right. Well, let's go ahead and continue grabbing these saplings. All right, and that that should do it. I mean, we got two saplings of acacia and birch. That should be okay. That should get us onto a good start. So, I mean, once you lay a couple down, more should more should fall, right? I think I'm lost. I don't think I'm going the right way. Where's that ocean? Where Where's that tropical area? That's what I'm looking for. There we go. Yeah, I need I need to go this way. All right, we're back on track. All right, <laughs> Whew. close call. It I've noticed a lot. It's a lot easier to get lost in the ocean in a boat or while you're swimming around. Um, I remember old Minecraft. You you could really tell which way the lines were going, uh, like the straight lines, like where the blocks still were and everything, and. They've made it a lot smoother, so you can't really see those lines very well. I, I mean, you can kind of see it just a little bit. But I still get confused very easily because it's so faint, and I think I'm traveling in a direct straight line. And then I'll look up at the coordinates there at the top left and notice, nope. You're moving in two different axes. Axes. Axes? 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 I think it's axes. Regardless, I'm moving in two different directions. And you can see here, I'm kind of going straight, but barely moving over to the left a little bit. But we're going to get home. Not a very productive episode. And, uh, well, that's just how Minecraft goes sometimes. And I want to try to keep these videos short. So I think this video is going to be about 25 and a half minutes, possibly. Um, well, my first video was like 46 minutes and I'm, I don't blame people for only watching it for 24 minutes. So if I can keep these videos down to 20 to 25 minutes, I hope that the view duration of my videos starts to get closer to 100% rather than 50%. Um, that'd be great. Um, it helped my channel out a lot and help keep me motivated to continue doing this so that'd be awesome
But yeah, we're, we're going to head back and we're just going to get these saplings uh, planted. And then I think we're going to call it a day. So there we are. We're almost home. I'm coming home. What? I don't know the song. You know the thing, right? You know, like Joe Biden says, you know the thing. You, you know the song. All right, let's get these down and... I think that's going to be all for me. So thanks for stopping by and I will see you in the next one.